Look at this fun set backlit shot. Good evening. So we're doing it. After many, many hours, it's been like a couple weeks, right? Yeah, a couple weeks have been going on. We're finally checking out, not Yeehaw Bob, not our favorite Mark, but we're checking out this here trivia that they got going on at Riverside. Um, I like people going here because like, you all know like we love this resort. So let's see if we can uh, pull out the old trivia, trivia knowledge and win some free recreational events. We are the Seven Caballeros. We got that one though. Peter from the Brookwater Project. We're gonna do the following beyond your ball. We set the question. We finally made it out. After every five questions, we'll do the reading. Keep up the great work. You guys look really, really enjoyable. I watch it every day. After your five tables, we're gonna look around and say hello to our friendly neighbors. Hello, friendly neighbors. Hello, friendly neighbors. All right. So y'all be great, each other. Which Disney character set this book? We're hijacking the vlog this time. What's we, our name? What's we, our team? Oh, oh, our team name? No, 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 go away. You're not on this team. He's not on this team. He can't be in this clip. She's in shock right now. But I want to tell you our team name. We are turned down for Walt. Every day. Next round, Disney royalty. Who had 20 or more? Oh my god! And who had 21 or more? Oh! Okay, got 20, got 20 or more. All right, we got we a tiebreaker round. So we got two. Oh, we got another team. Okay, so we got three-way tie. Oh, All right, so we got three teams. I only need one member. We got a tiebreaker. Veronica is up for sudden death. <laughs> oh my gosh! I can do work on it, but I can't do tennis. Yes, you can. Yeah, you can exactly. do it. In the year 2003, the American Film Institute released their <laughs> list of the top 50 greatest movie villains. The Evil Queen from Snow White and the Seven Doors appears on this list ranked at what number? I right, start over here, start with your number. You got 30, you got 6, and you got 6. What? Alright. We did it. The answer was 10. Oh. So I'm going to do another tiebreaker. <laughs> Yeah, that could be nice. What are you doing? <laughs> How tall and feet is Sleeping Beauty Castle at Disneyland Park in California? Let's see your answers. What is your answer? You want to check? You got 55? You read out? 53? Correct answer? 77 feet. So we have our red Which Disney character said that line? Mm -hmm. Number two, the line is. Now don't don't you get any foolish ideas that magic will solve all your problems because it won't. So the third round is respect your elders and it's not looking good. Pass on what you have learned. Strength, mastery, but weakness, folly, failure also. Yes, failure, most of all. The greatest teacher failure is. Staffer and Waldorf are two elderly, elderly drunks who sit in the theater balcony of what attraction at Disney's Hollywood Studios? We are in the quietest place in the whole land. Look at this. In the buggiest. The quietest and buggiest, but we're in this like big gazebo. Magnolia Bend. Magnolia Bend, Port Orleans Riverside. I think the pool's closing. Is it 11? It's almost 11. Yep. It's 10 to 11. Um, what, what, like 30 minutes ago? The yeah. trivia ended? None of us won. We were pretty close, us girls. Yeah. But the last, the last topic was respect your elders. So it was all el about elderly characters. And the last little section was like the voices of characters who was older. Like the voice actor or actress. The voice actor of the characters. And that's where we lost it. Um, yeah. It was a lot of yeah. fun. Definitely come check it out if they're still doing it when you're down here. It's, at it's every Tuesday, 8.30. Three rounds, 15 questions each, plus a bonus question. 
Yeah. Um, kids are allowed. Yeah. It's by the bar. There were some kids it's a doing lounge. a lot of. It's the same place where Yeehaw um, Bob. Yeah. Is. So like River bring Roost. your kids. Um, there was a family. Did so you see the two fun. little kids that were like killing it? Oh no. It was a lot of fun. We, we had like a big table. We um, split into two groups as yeah. you saw the camera go from side to side. Yeah, yeah. So there was a lot of fun people we hung out with tonight that we've mm -hmm. been like meaning to hang out with. Over the WDW the, couple, yeah. Paging Mr. Morrow. Construct we'll, Deb we'll was, was here for a little bit. Yeah, we'll link all the different channels below. They're all awesome. They're all super nice. Um, they were just very welcoming because like they've been coming here for three weeks now. Yeah. It's been going on. This is the third or fourth week. They've been coming here and they they do a lot of they do a lot of hanging out um, outside of these Tuesday things that we just don't. I mean. You guys see how busy we are doing everything else in our life, so uh, we haven't had a chance. And uh, Prince Charming Dev and us talked about seeing them back at Animal Kingdom. Yeah, all of them. We talked yeah. to all of them about hanging out back in the Animal Kingdom um, right. anniversary, and we haven't seen any of them. It's been the craziest summer ever. So hopefully now with the fall, food and wine, all that sort of stuff, we'll definitely and be the food seeing and them wine. around more. And, and Sean nice wasn't able like... to come. And Sean's at WWE tonight. Yeah, it was nice to just like have the time to like relax. Yeah, we weren't. It wasn't for a special event. It wasn't nothing was right. going on. We weren't. We doing weren't in things. the parks. Where we were it's... all like, I honestly think we were the ones vlogging the most. Yeah. And I didn't really see them too well, much. Well, they probably have a couple weeks worth of. Yeah. There. Yeah, and I saw Nate a little bit pulling mm -hmm. the camera out here or there, um, which was cool because like we've told you guys before, like, we like to just like talk to people and build a friendship. Yeah, so but we like were able to do that while filming tonight. I got some dirty looks from the girls because <laughs> I was being a facetious player. Peter is. The perfect pesterer. I am a really good pesterer. So it's just in my it's like in my DNA. What are we gonna do? What do you wanna do? Let's walk around. Yeah. We can't stay out late, but we're doing the whole like one AM. I think we think we changed it. We're gonna go to bed at one and get up at seven. Before Peter was more so getting to work early, like as he was like getting used to the new job. But he's like settled, so he was like, you know what? I'm I usually am the first person there. I'm still Not probably in the first twenty percent of people in the office. Yeah. When I leave at seven, I get there a little after eight. Right. So, but before I, I get like there, that's like when we usually like naturally wake up. So yeah. the first like seven months of us living here, I'd get to work at like seven twenty, and me and my boss at the time would like neck and neck, like show up one after mm -hmm. another, and the lights would always be off. We'd always be the first people there, and then nobody else would show up until like eight or eight yeah, thirty. So. so it was like, I mean, I was getting comfortable. I, I, there's no, there's far less traffic at that earlier time. Um, but now I'm just like I just want to sleep some, mm -hmm. and I and you know it's your okay. Job and I know my job. I get there still at the same time as the rest of the people on my team. Yeah. Um, my boss doesn't mind. So. Yeah, I'm fine. Like the 1 a.m. to 7 a.m. Sounds like a good time. Well, I should actually still get the six to run. came inside because we saw the screen playing. We thought it was a Disney movie, but it's Disney Junior. I got us some water. One of my favorite things about this food court is the mixed max chairs. What? Do you realize it's not a movie? What? It smells like the most fresh, delicious cheese pizza. <laughs> it smells like vacation and... and now I'm, I'm mad. We're back like, <laughs> it's very like, perspective, Peter, but like, I wish we were staying here, so like I'm we'll walking on the road and I'm really enjoying it, but I'm like, I just wish we were staying here, and then I have to tell myself, like, I live here, like, this is my Tuesday night. Yeah. So, like, I still just want to, like, go back to a room with Stacy and Eve. Set at 55 degrees. And Eve? Yeah. And Eve with us. She can stay here. She can, in a special doggy room, because she's a princess. In a Princess Tiana, Princess Eve room. She is, we joke around saying that her full name is Evangeline. We're secretly trying to see if we can change the channel and turn on Stacy. No oh, <gasps> Check the cabinet for a remote. No buttons? No buttons. Are you sure? Check the back. Like the back back. Ask a cast member. No, let's go home. What? I need to get Stacy. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. 
think it would be down, yeah. I do it. Remember when we said goodbye to her? <laughs> Was that a week ago? A week ago yesterday. Warhol, we're gonna do our sign offs in front of our backsplashes now. We're home. Yeah, wonderful time. We did. Make sure you check out all the links down below of everybody we were hanging out with. We also forgot to mention we were with Tip of the Ears. Mm hmm. They were great. Um, yeah, we had a really fun cool time. Cool tattoos. Um, we had a lot of fun. I wanna go back. We gotta bring some of our friends over to trivia over the next couple weeks. So if you're our friend, and it's different. It's different categories every time. Yeah, yeah. So uh, if you're our friend and you know who you are, then like just be prepared on Tuesdays to go hang out with us, all of you. At the River Roost. And if you're ever going to be there, let us know. Like you know, our plans are pretty fluid at times. So if you're ever going to be at the River Roost for trivia, let us know. Maybe we'll stop by. Maybe we'll join you. All that good stuff. If you don't know this, when you're watching this vlog, it'll be our third and a wedding anniversary. So we're going to Paddlefish tomorrow for dinner, mm -hmm. or tonight when you're watching this. We got married three years ago. It's pretty fun. Mm -hmm. It's the greatest day of my life, hands yeah. down. I post. I already posted some throwback pictures, but I'm sure we'll post the video somewhere. And such a yeah. treasure. We'll it's put like that best either in this link or tomorrow, like the next day's vlog. Let's put it in both. Yeah. Let's put it in this one so you can watch it. But it's like my no. I always say like I always mess this up, but I always say um, my number one favorite thing about. Our anniversary, like our wedding day, was that we got married. <laughs> and my second favorite thing is this is our video. Like yeah. I love it. It's so. It's my good. absolute favorite thing. Yeah. That like I quote unquote. I like own. can't believe it's us. Right. I just love it, and mm -hmm. it's like it really sums up like our wedding and how we love each other, and that day and how Chicago we and Disney hinted and everything. It's it's perfect. So yeah. it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>